Faye Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Nefertiti. I'm going to come a little bit above the middle and put a dot. And from that dot going towards the left, I draw a curve line down, little curve line in, little curve line down, and stop. Come back to the dot. We're going to draw it on the right hand side, curve line down, little curve line in, curve line over, connect. Come on the left hand side and we're going to draw a curve line out, curve line in, connect on the left, curve line out, curve line in on the right. Come over here on the left and we're going to draw a curve line and swoop up on the left, curve line, swoop up on the right. Come back to the left and we're going to draw a curve line down over connect. Come on the right, curve line down over connect. Come back to the left and we're going to draw a curve line inside. And then we're going to come on the right, draw a curve line inside, inside. Come back to the left and we're going to mimic this top line, swoop. Come on the right, mimic that line, swoop. Come above that line and we're going to draw a little curve line out, in, connect on the left and a little curve line out in connect on the right. Come down towards the center and just do one, two little dash lines, straight lines. Come back on the left. We're going to draw a curve line up, in, up, out. Come back to the left, draw a curve line across, connect. Come inside on this space on the left and we're just going to draw a wavy line on the left and a wavy line on the right. Okay, come back to the left, watch what I do. I draw a straight diagonal up on the left, come on the right hand side, straight diagonal up on the right. Come back to the left and we're going to connect the two with a slightly curved line. Come right in the center and we're going to draw a straight line down, curve line out, straight line down on the left. Come on the right hand side, straight line down, curve line out, straight line down. Right at the bottom, slightly curved line, connect. Come right about here on the left and we're going to draw a straight line up, curve line over, straight line in, connect, come back up to the top and on the left hand side we're going to draw a little curved line connect on the left, little curved line connect on the right. Right here at this indentation I draw a slightly curved line to the right on top, slightly curved line to the right on the bottom, jump over, we're going to do the same on the left, slightly curved line connect on the left, Come to the bottom, slightly curved line, connect. Inside we're going to put little straight lines all the way across, jump over, little straight lines all the way across. Okay, come all the way down here on the left. We're going to draw a straight line down on the left. We're going to draw a straight line down on the right. Come back to the left and we're going to draw a curve line over, connect. Right here where we stopped and drew the other curve line, now we take that point and draw a straight diagonal out on the left, straight diagonal out on the right. Come back to the left and we're going to draw a big curve line up and over. See how that doesn't quite connect? I just connect it with that straight line. Come inside and we're going to draw curved lines, curved lines. See how many you can draw? We're all going to probably end up with a different amount. Now come back inside, 
top part I'm just going to do little straight lines all the way across bottom next one I'm just going to draw some circles inside the space now if you want to do a different design you can this is just what I'm doing right now next one I think I did diagonal straight lines going across all the way across and on the bottom I did little straight lines now like I said you can make your own designs if you want these are the ones that I chose to do real simple okay let me see if I've got everything yes now before we start coloring I'm just gonna go ahead and color in this section on the left black this section on the right black I'm gonna come in and do this section on the left black this section on the right black okay let's see how we're gonna color this in okay Nefertiti was an Egyptian so this is important to remember to color this is her neck we're gonna color it light brown these are her ears we're gonna color that light brown and we're gonna carefully color her face all light brown not too dark but she definitely had some color okay once we've done that the three colors we're going to be using are the primary colors we're going to be using red so I'm going to do her lips red we're going to be using yellow because this is gold but I don't have gold so I'm using yellow and I'm going to fill in some of my squares of her design and then I'm going to come down and fill in some of these designs with my yellow and that's what I do I work my way down using the same color filling in spots so I don't get mixed up on what I'm doing because we all know I can become easily confused and I think that's it with the yellow next I come in with my red okay so I'm going to do this top part with red bring it down do this part of her necklace red some of my squares red some of my base squares red and then I come in with dark blue which I assume could be lapis lazuli which is a cobalt dark blue that they used a lot in ancient artifacts so that's all blue and then anything that I haven't colored in with red or yellow I'm gonna finish coloring in with blue okay all the way across let's see what she looks like all colored in okay here's Nefertiti all colored in ready to rule over ancient Egypt okay bye bye